The church often celebrates early Christian saints who were both virgins and martyrs, but today we honor two women who were mothers and martyrs. Their names are Perpetua and Felicity, and they were killed for the Christian faith around the beginning of the third century. Hello, I'm Father James Kubicki, and these two saints were so popular and important to the early church that their names were included in the Roman canon, the Eucharistic prayer that to this day is one of the options that can be chosen at Mass. According to tradition, Perpetua was only about 22, the daughter of a pagan nobleman and the mother of a young child. She and her servant Felicity were imprisoned for being catechumens, people who were preparing to become full-fledged Christians by being baptized. Their instructor, Saturus, joined them in prison where they were baptized and received into the fullness of life in Christ. Their execution was delayed because Felicity was pregnant and Roman law forbade the execution of pregnant women. I imagine that at one point the authorities argued with them, telling them to think of their children and what would happen to them if the two mothers didn't renounce their faith so that they could be there to raise them. But the women held fast to the faith. They knew that there is something more important than the life of our bodies. They wanted their children to be raised in the faith, and they trusted that somehow God would take care of them after their deaths. During Lent, we can pray that we too may have our priorities right, and that our children are cared for not only physically, but most importantly, spiritually.